it has not been one of his better days. Well, he's the star of the football team, and they win games because of him. So if he's not having a good day, usually that means just what we're seeing here. They're losing. So find a way to get him more involved. Maybe throw him the pass if that's what it takes. But get this offense, and especially this run game, rolling. The second quarter is underway with this snap. He's averaged about two yards a carry on the day. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to, and also it opens up so many other things for your offense. The Bills take it from the 28. The Bills now move the chains. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Jim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. They bring in the extra tight end. Oh, you see the linebackers moving around. I think they're trying to confuse the offensive line. The Bills run the risk right now of having to abandon the running game. McCoy is going to get more touches, and you know he has to learn how to find some openings to get his team back in this one. You know, I agree with that, Jim, but also I think you got to start to think about changing the play calling, get this defense off balance, then go back to the run and see if you can catch him off guard. Second and seven on the way. The Patriots come out in a dime package. The Bills will take the snap from the 35. McCoy up the middle. High towers there that time for the tackle. McCoy's tried to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short game. An open lane. Manuel is going to cut his losses here as he slides to a finish. It's not as easy as it looks. That quarterback, good job of sliding before he takes the hit that time. First down here. McCoy is handed the football. McCoy's never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. To the two yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. McCoy's gonna take the handoff now. McCoy is a dangerous runner when you give him room to run, but there is no room this time. What a job by the defense, they bottle him up for a short game. Seven coming up. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. The Bills have it at the 44. Launching it deep. Intercepted. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. Loss of four on the play. 
The Patriots offense Phil was on a roll right now with touchdowns coming on each of their last two possessions. Can they make it three in a row right here? Well we're going to find out. I like their chances. What have we seen that makes us think that they're not going to come out there and get it done. They're, they're playing exceptional football on the offensive side. Real tough starting spot here for the offense. Here's the handoff to LeGarrette Blount. And he'll officially touch the player, the down player, right there. The Bills guessed right on the defensive side that time. They thought it was going to be a run play. They were all over it, and they got it in the backfield and made the tackle. Second down and 11. Blunt. Is going to make the tackle. And with these incredible rushing numbers, it's no surprise to see this team on top. They are dominating on the offensive line. There's no question about that. They're being very physical, and that's why they're leading this football game. Third and ten coming up. the Patriots come to the line the first down marker is at the 16th will go ground he's brought down that's gonna bring up fourth down the Patriots decide to go for a run here on third and long and look not second guessing that play call not many in the playbook in the passing game they're gonna pick up a first down they go with the run the defense is not fooled and now they're gonna have to punt Watkins got it on the return. He's brought down right around the 43-yard line. And a run back of about 20. Watkins is able to show off his talent on that pump return that time. What speed and quickness that allows him to break through some of that coverage and picks up good yards. The Bills back onto the field. Of course, the last drive they had it. It looked like they were going to put up some points only to watch the football get picked off in opponent's territory. Smart defensive coach they're going against in this game today. He knows how to put his players in positions to make plays, and he did that last drive, and they came up with the INT. Was that on the quarterback, or was that just a great play by the defender? I'm giving most of the credit to the defender. It's just a good play. Second and one coming up. He's going to secure the handoff. The tackle is made, and the first down is picked up. McCoy is a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. Coming to the line at the 43. First down at the 43. McCoy has it out of the eye. The Patriots defense is so fast and so powerful. That time on the run play, they just overpower the offensive line. And they tackle the runner for a loss. Coming to the line at the 44. Second and 11. Catch made near the sideline. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down. Jim, that's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. First down on the way. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play.
holding offense. The defense accepts the penalty. First down. The Patriots go with the dime formation here on defense. The Bills take it from the 33. Watkins has got it on a pass. Had some heat on it. How about the way he always locks in and concentrates on the catch? Man, he's got hands like glue. When you shake his hand, he can break yours because that's how strong they are. So not surprised to see him just reach out and just snatch the football out of the air. Manuel's completion percentage, 70% on the day. First down by the offense inside the red zone. Can the defense show them something different here and keep them from scoring a touchdown? Playing press coverage to the outside. First down and 10. Williams taking the handoff. Williams is trying to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short gain. Coming up to the line at the 11. There's a flag out. Neutral zone infraction, defense. That's what happens when you try to guess the sound count. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Williams got it on the handoff. That's Hicks making the stop. The Bills are giving ground, but if they can make a stop here inside the 10, it'll be interesting to see what happens on fourth down. Yeah, well, listen, the offense has to find a way to score on this play here, get into the end zone, and get back into this football game. Who are they going to give it to, a running back, or are they going to try and trick the defense and throw the football? Manuel from the gun. My goodness, what a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. The Bills know to win in the NFL, you got to pick up third downs. It doesn't matter how you do it. Third and short, they go with the pass. Not executed very well. Now it's fourth down. A short field goal try on the way. The kick is good. And that should put them a little more at ease come halftime. Yeah, I think it will. I think it gave them a confidence boost. And they, they gained confidence. On the other side, I think they lost confidence because of that field goal. Dan Carpenter readying his team for the kickoff. Bolton's going to start his return. And he'll step out. That return's good for about 21. The Patriots weren't able to get anything out of their last drive and were forced to punt as they take the field here. Do you think they are going to vary their approach, Phil? Well, I hope so. I think they will. They, they got a lot of information out there in that short drive, Jim, and you do that by showing different formations and plays. You saw how the defense reacted to it. Now you counter-react and see if you can get some positive plays. I'm sure they're tired of being in the three and out business. Well, that's a bad business to be in. I know I get in a lot of bad businesses. First down at the 27. Graham's there to take him down. Nice run that time. You run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. At the 34, 66 yards from pay dirt. The Bills defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. The Patriots have it at the 34. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. 
What a good job by the running back that time. He reads the blocks very well, and he picks his way through there and picks up a first down. That's, that's nice.